These are easy chords for beginners. No need for a dramatic intro when the chords themselves are not dramatic. So how I'm gonna set this up is I'm gonna show you the easy chords and I'm gonna give you three patterns to play through and you'll be able to drill all the chords I'm gonna show you. The chords I'm leaving out are power chords. Those are cool, you should play them for all rock music, but I'm going to actually focus on chords you strum that are multiple strings and blah, 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 things you wanna do as a beginner. There are eight chords plus one seven chord, and I've taught thousands of lessons. I think this works, but whatever. Feel free to thumbs down it. So our major chords are C, A, G, E, and D. Those are the major chords, and our minor chords are A minor, E minor, and D minor, and our seven chord is B7. So, I'm gonna show you how to play those. We're gonna do the three song structures to teach you how to play all those chords in a sequence. Going from the ceiling to the floor, fat string equals fat number, low E is string six, high E is one, small number, small string, that number, six, that string. So, the C major chord is starting on string five, three, call out frets, three, two, skip a string, one, zero. Your A major chord is starting on string five, open string, means you don't squeeze anything down, two, 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 and an open string. So you gotta tilt your hand, so you can fit all your fingers in there. That's your A chord. G. Three, two, zero, 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 three. That's your D chord. You can use your third finger here or your pinky, and there's a bunch of other ways, but those are the most common ones for G. E major. Zero, two, two, one, zero, zero. E major, all day. Zero, two, two, one, zero, zero and your D major chord. Zero, zero. My zero is turned on string five. Zero, zero, two, three, two. Two, three, two. And those are all your major chords. C, A, G, E, D. It spells caged. Now, your minor chords are A minor, starting on string five. Zero, two, two, one, zero. It's only one number change between the A and the A minor. Our uh, E minor, zero, two, two, zero, zero, zero. And our D minor is uh, holding down frets two, three, and one on strings three, two, and one. So two, three, one on strings three, two, and one. And our B7 chord, starting on string five, two, one, two, zero, two. Boring as hell, but you need to know it. So here are three structures you can play to practice all of those chords. So we're gonna do E, zero, two, two, one, zero, zero, to B7, two, one, two, zero, two, to A, Zero, two, 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 zero, back to E. So if you play with a rhythm, it would sound like. Now let's do G, C, and D. So your G, three, two, zero, 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 three, to your C, Three two zero one to your D two three two on the thinnest strings back to G three two zero zero three and that would sound like and now let's nail those minor chords. This is going to be A minor, D minor. E minor back to A minor. So your A minor, zero, two, two, one, zero. That's starting on string five, zero, two, two, one, zero. So your D minor, starting on string five, zero, two, two, one, zero. 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 Zero,
starting on string four, zero, two, three, one, to E minor, zero, two, two, zero, 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 back to A minor, zero, two, two, one, zero. This is like the most boring thing in the world, but somebody needs this, so we're doing it. How could you play this to make it sound cool? A minor, D minor, E minor, A minor, let's do it. time because it's fun. Decoration. There's your eight basic chords and a way you can practice them and do just nail it down. I know the boring shit happens in the beginning. That's what makes a beginner. Fight through that. Get to the cool stuff. I'll see you.